What's going on there, folks? Earthmaster here, jumping in once again. Got a major earthquake coming in to the uh, Earthquake Live 3D Station channel. Um, it is, once again, March 4th, 2021, 9.52 p.m. or a.m. We just did an update video on this 7.3 striking out there in the uh, New Zealand area. Now we have a major, larger earthquake. Uh, we were just talking about the potential of seeing a larger earthquake within the region above the 7.3. And now it looks like that is the case. A 7.5 earthquake just striking to the north of the region that we've seen all the activity there in the uh, uh, New Zealand area this morning. Pretty major development here. Um, definitely could be a potential uh, tsunami with this earthquake. We'll check that out here in just a second. Um, actually, we'll check that off right off the bat just to be safe. Striking at about 10 kilometers below the surface for the 7.5. There is a tsunami threat um, from this earthquake. We'll go ahead and check the details of this real quick. This just striking a couple minutes ago, folks. Um, uh, based on preliminary earthquake parameters, uh, hazardous tsunami waves are possible for coasts located with, within 300 kilometers of the epicenter of this earthquake. Of course, we did see this uh, same statement from the tsunami.gov website folks on the 7.3. Luckily, there was no earthquake. This one here, a little bit different, uh, a little bit larger magnitude. Of course, any uh, higher step up of magnitude is a major, uh, more of a major release of pressure than the, uh, the prior magnitude. Uh, let's see what else we got here. <clears throat> So right now there is a tsunami threat, folks. Um, we will of course, a couple of these are saying uh, based on earthquake information and historic tsunami records, this earthquake is not expected to generate a tsunami, but uh, there still is a tsunami threat there uh, within about uh, 300 kilometers of the epicenter. So be on guard, be prepared, folks. Um, this is definitely getting very, uh, very, very interesting here. Uh, so just a real quick recap. We had a 7.3 this morning in uh, right around the uh, Hikurangi subduction zone area. I did include that video of the uh, Hikurangi subduction zone um, in my latest update video towards the end. You'll have to check it out there. Uh, 7.3 striking, right? Right around that northern end of the Hikurangi. Pacific Plate uh, and, and the Australian Plate, that subduction zone there. Uh, and then right after that, couple, like an hour or so, short time ago, um, there was a 6.1 up here near the uh, Vanuatu region. Now we're seeing that 7.5 uh, within that chromatic trench region south of Tonga uh, and uh, right around the, uh, well, right around the uh, chromatic islands of uh, New Zealand there. Definitely a uh, be on guard, folks. I'm going to cut this video off short just to uh, update this um, earthquake that just struck. Once again, there is still a tsunami statement. Tsunami um, warning here real quick. Hold on. Let me go back here see if I can find it. It's all fluttered today. So much stuff going on. There is a tsunami threat. Once again, 7.5 um, from this pretty large earthquake. And as of right now... We'll check out the non-U.S., right, which would include New Zealand area. This is their latest statement. Based on the preliminary earthquake uh, parameters, hazardous waves are possible for coasts located within 300 kilometers of the earthquake of this 7.5 quake, folks. So be on guard. We'll chat at you here in a little bit. Stay safe. 